Sometimes people use the term sexy. My grandma just said sexy, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Life with Noobs. Noobs fam, welcome back to Life with Noobs. I have a special guest here today. My grandmother is back for another lit video. Hello. Hi. She is here and we are going to test her knowledge just a little bit to see how young and hip she may be. Who knows? <laughs> <laughs> so Nana, you are going to have to guess what the acronym for L-O-L means. That one I think I know, laugh out loud. Wow, right. <laughs> okay. We're off to a good start. <laughs> the second slang term mm. is YOLO. This is another acronym, YOLO. YOLO. That, I have no idea. Is it mean I'm going down low? Good guess, good guess. So what if I put it in context for you? Okay. What if I said, you know what? I'm gonna eat that ice cream cone because why not? YOLO. It's the last one. It's delicious. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no <laughs> idea. No idea. <laughs> so YOLO actually means you only live once. Oh. Oh. Have you ever heard of that before? No. And apparently, Noobs fam, it was Drake who coined this term. Is that right? YOLO. Mm. The next slang term okay. is, mm. drum roll, <laughs> goat. So goat. if I say, let me give you some context here. If I say, you are the goat. <laughs> I am the goat. It means I'm either the foolish one or I am the... The, the one that everybody's dumping on. Hmm. So GOAT is another acronym. Yes. Yeah? Uh -huh. So what do you think the letters G-O-A-T could stand for? The word GOAT. <laughs> An animal named GOAT. GOAT actually stands for greatest of all time. Is that right? Yes. Mm. Funny story is that I taught my students what goat meant. I was like, does anybody know what goat means? And they were like, no. I'm like, well, it means greatest of all time. And then one of them tur turns to me and says, oh, miss, you're a goat. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> I was like, thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> so if ever someone calls you a goat, oh. that's actually a good thing. Thank you for letting me know that. Just saying. Yes. Now, the next slang term is slay. Slay? Yes. Like this slay that one would ride in the winter? So that <laughs> is one kind of slay. Uh -huh. But if I say, wow, your outfit looks good. You're slaying. Or your hair. Okay, slay, you're, girl. You're really, in my time, you say you're really hip. You're hip, exactly, a little hip. Yes. <laughs> it's kind of the same expression. Okay. So instead of being like, oh, wow, you're hip, you would be like, wow, slay girl, or your makeup, slay. It kind of means like work it, like that's great, that's amazing, whoa. You're looking really special. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. <laughs> okay, I think I got the meaning of it. The next slang term is T. And what I mean by tea, if someone comes up to you and asks you, do you have the tea? Oh. What do they mean? Am I going golfing? <laughs> okay. <laughs> because you use a tea in golfing. Oh, I didn't think yes, of that. Yes, you put it and uh, yes. I think it's a little piece that you put the ball on before you hit it. Yeah, yes. that is called a tea, but it's not that kind of tea. It actually refers to the tea you drink. Oh. Some people can say, so spill the tea. Ah, uh, means tell what's going on. Exactly. Uh, that one wasn't so hard. Yeah. Yes, spill so the, the tea. The gossip, uh -huh. tell me what the uh -huh. gossip is. Uh -huh. And some people actually refer to the tea as being cold or hot. I see, I see. So you're, 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 you could ask someone, 
So is the tea cold or is the tea hot? Uh -huh. Meaning the tea is fresh. You just heard it from someone else. I see. That would be, what oh. do you think, hot or cold? Hot. Hot, yes. yes. And then if the tea is cold, that would mean that it's kind of like old news. Okay. Mm. You could carry a conversation all evening using slangs and I'd be sitting there not knowing what's happening, right? But mm. now you will know what's happening. Exactly. Exactly. New Sam. <laughs> Another slang term is the word ballin'. We're ballin'. Meaning you're having a good time, a party. Yeah. A party. Okay. Yeah, you're okay. ballin'. Yeah. Kind of, you're having a good time. time. Either you have a lot of money. Yeah. Have you ever seen people do this before? Um, no. <laughs> That's making it rain, by oh. the way. <laughs> making it rain with what? Money. Yeah, with I money. See. So ah. if you're ballin', usually yes. you're making it rain. You're with you're ballin' with money, with with designer clothes, with jewelry. You're flashing. Yeah. As they would say in another way. Exactly. Okay. You're flashing. If I were to say they're flexing, you see those people over there? They're flexing. What is to flex? The action to flex. Flex. It's a, when you flex your muscle, you're actually posing. You're actually, you know, seeing what your agility is. Okay. Or maybe how strong you are. Okay. So okay. that is to flex. Like yes, that's yes. actually doing mm -hmm. the movement. Yes. But what if I were to say, do you see? Do you see them over there? They're flexing. They're posing. They want to be seen. Yeah, they want to be seen. When they're flexing, they're trying to show off. Yeah, okay. So it's like, oh, they're they're either, I mean, it's just showing off. <laughs> yeah, it's plain and simple. Yeah, so that is to flex. Very interesting. I like that one, mm -hmm. flexing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So what if I were to ask you to look at my eyebrows mm -hmm. and I said, are my eyebrows on fleek? What would you say? On fleek? Not a clean word. <laughs> no, it's on fleek. Do you, it, does it mean that you have no eyebrows, you shave them off? <laughs> <laughs> so on fleek is actually another way to say on point. Oh. So, wow, your eyebrows are on fleek. Oh. Like, they're, they're on point. Okay. You had them nicely fixed and you're really looking very impressive. Exactly, right. exactly. So my eyebrows are on fleek right mm. now. By the way, Noobs fam, I am wearing this super cute romper that I made in my last few videos so go check it out check out the description box down below what do you have to tell them nana go fleek <laughs> or there she's fleeking <laughs> i'm fleeking <laughs> right now with this romper my romper is on point <laughs> no my romper is on i have no idea what on fleek, on fleek. <laughs> Your romper is on fleek. Thank hey. you. <laughs> I'm flexing. Yeah. <laughs> I won't laugh out loud. Hello. No, no. <laughs> She's got it. She's catching on. <laughs> so another acronym is FOMO. So F-O-M-O. -O. FOMO. FOMO. Mm -hmm. It's almost like saying for me. FOMO. Hmm. For me? For me? Good guess. Good guess. So FOMO stands for fear of missing out. Ooh. <laughs> so if I'm saying, if I know there's a party going on right now and I'm at home and I'm, I wasn't invited to this party, I would say I'm experiencing major FOMO okay. right now. Okay, you're missing out. Exactly. I see. Exactly. Hmm. Now this one, I think you can guess. Okay. Bay. Spelled bay. B E Y? <laughs> no. Spelled B A E. <laughs> oh, bay. You're my bay. Oh, my, my, my date? My girlfriend? My boo? Yeah. Oh. Like my boo. Exactly. So, okay. bay, people will refer to bay as their significant other. other. So, okay. be like, my you're person. my bay, or I want you to be my bay, or you'll just call them by that name. I and... see. Hi, bay. Exactly. Okay. Yeah. It's not too far from saying babe, you know. <laughs> exactly. Pretty babe. much. Someone have... just had the genius, or maybe not so genius idea, mm -hmm. <laughs> to take away the second B, yes. and instead of babe, it, yes. it's just bay. bay. We have two more slang terms, noob spam. Are you ready? Are you ready? Now? Yes, I am. I'm having fun and I'm thinking about it, even though I don't remember what you, all of the ones you've just told me, I'm still <laughs> having fun learning something new. Good, 
<laughs> if I use your terms, you'll be the hip grandma. Yes. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> the second to last slang term is snatched. Snatch? Snatched. So, wow, you're snatched right now. Snatched. Meaning that you're you're taken? Hmm. I or, never thought of it like that. Right? Or, <laughs> I guess I want to snatch you. Yeah. <laughs> or you're taken, meaning I belong to some, I'm a partnering up with someone else. Mm -hmm. Snatch. Mm. Does it have something to do with um, your appearance? It does. Yes. You're onto something. Okay. It sounds almost like you're not flecking. What is that? What is Fleeking, that? Fleeking or flexing. Flexing, yes. It it's, sounds like flexing. It's almost meaning the same thing. Uh, yeah. It has to do with flexing okay. is someone watching you usually this would be a compliment so someone might look at you see. and maybe you're flexing maybe you're not but you'll say wow you look snatched or ah. that waist is snatched it's like cinched is is on again another way to say on point, point. okay it, sometimes people use the term sexy mm -hmm. and I, i'm not sure what it really 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 means but it, it could be a, a similar idea my grandma just said sexy guys <laughs> <laughs> you know after a while you just repeat the things you hear whatever they may mean right that. right that. the last but not least final term is dl 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 if oh. i say can hmm. you keep this on the dl ah don't know I'm impressed. I'm <laughs> impressed. One point for Dana. <laughs> Name me three slang terms that you remember. You're groovy? No, that was not one of the terms. <laughs> Laugh out loud. GL. Uh, flexing. The one for the eyebrow again. Point on point. Fleek. Fleek. Okay. Fleek. Okay. Those I think I got. Don't remember anymore. Okay, that's not bad. <laughs> I'll take it, noobs fam. So that was the end of our session. Do you feel like you understand, you know, the hip lingo that's going on now? A little bit. And if I'm hanging out with the young crowd, I won't feel so lost because I can understand a few of the expressions. So keep me young. Good. <laughs> We're keeping her young. Thank you, Nana, for joining me. Anytime, my beauty. Make sure to like, subscribe, turn your post notifications on, and give this video what, Nana? A thumbs up. A big thumbs up. I will see you in the next lit video. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Life with noobs.